This is an example for thin wall pressure vessel. On this example, I'm going to use the barbecue propane tank. So, what's how to design a barbecue propane tank? Uh, typically, the pressure inside the propane tank varies between 150, between 20 psi to 150. The you have to account for the welding efficiency, also the factor of safety for material if you yield strain or ultimate strain depends on that now this tank is about 18 inch tall and 12 it's inside outside diameter so it looks like something like this most of you have seen the barbecue propane tank so uh, it's kind of difficult to draw so like that and then you got a pressure gauge there somewhere so this tank check the earlier video that the long circumferential stress this way is twice more than the longitudinal stress so this is stress is the longitudinal stress tensile longitudinal stress this way tensile longitudinal stress so this is twice more than the stress developed in the longitudinal direction. So whenever there is a design problem, we should be actually designing for the circumferential stress if it looks like a cylinder, like your mm, welding cylinder, the oxyacetylene cylinder. They look like this, like that. Um, so anytime something look like a cylinder you should be using for if it's a design problem so for the circumferential stress because this way is going to fail just by half of the load inside pressure because the stress is twice so the formula for the you can check the other video how and why they're twice in this formula so this is basically pd divided by two times the sigma 2t now if you solve for t then you get p d actually i inside diameter of the tank divide by the if it's a design problem then you can maximum use the allowable tensile stress so for the design problem this is the formula we're gonna be using now in this case we have to consider some more factors first of all the allowable stress so this part is now allowable stress so we know that to calculate allowable tensile stress we can use say yield strain let's use the ASTM A36 plate for that the ultimate stress is 58 KSI 1000 pounds Typically, when you use ultimate strain, use factor of safety of 3, so that will become 19.33. And then it also says, typically, you basically bend this plate and weld, weld, weld it together. So there is a 60% join efficiency. So account for that times 60%. So then you get only about 11.6 KSI allowable tensile stress for this design so that's the allowable for the pressure part that is a little bit complicated it says that 150 psi if the tank says in the store 150 psi so inside this store is probably around 70 uh, degree fahrenheit so you have to convert that to one of the extreme condition think about the barbecue tank is exposed is used in the summertime uh, outside it also close to the um, the stove so it will also develop even more um, more pressure inside because the temperature increases pressure increases so to account for that we have to as calculate the let's assume that the so the 150 psi is just in the room temperature assume that that is 70 degree Fahrenheit so 70 degree Fahrenheit plus 460 the absolute scale ranking scale should be used 
if the US customary unit is used like PSI and then P2 divided by assume that the temperature might go all the way up to 180 it's very unlikely um, let's think about the outside temperature is 110 which is very high again and also if it's close to this stove so this might develop some more um, temperature so let's say 180 or 190 something like that and then 460 so from here we can calculate the P2 I did that 198 maybe around 200 just for the sake of simplicity so 200 PSI maximum develop inside this tank barbecue tank now if I plug all this number 200 PSI inside pressure times the the outside diameter given inside is not given however the compared to the thickness we can think of very negligible so di inside is the outside diameter minus thickness because thickness is very very low we can simply say di is do so just multiply by 12 inches divide by the I think there was a 2 here I missed that times 11 6 ksi thousand pounds so if I solve for T I have found this is in thousand so you have to multiply by thousand here so that will be then in PSI so I, I got this T point one zero three inches now you will not find a plate that is this thing so you have to get some kind of a standard so one of the standard dimension would be uh, 1 by 8 thick inch thickness plate so we can find 1 8 thick thickness plate which is 0.125 more than uh, the thickness we need 0.103 so the answer would be we could use the 1 by 8 thickness plate for this barbecue tank design now if we consider the uh, thickness let's see if the calculation changes um, so T is equal to um, then it's gonna be 200 PSI times the 12 minus the thickness divided by the 2 times 11,600 PSI now if I solve for T from this equation it's gonna look like 116 T is equal to 12 minus T so 117 T is equal to 12 T is equal to 0.012 sorry 125 so this is again if we use 1 by 8 thickness plate which is 0.125 so this should be okay so the our answer would be 1 by 8 thickness plate for this barbecue tank design